okay lasses ladies and wonderful fabulous females dating when a guy says that you're too much for them or that you're intimidating what they actually mean is that they know that they're not good enough for you so remember that when a guy puts you down it's because they feel inferior and they know they are not good enough for you there's one thing that i've learned from all this dating and whatnot is I used to put my value in what a man thought of me and then honestly you could have whatever men sleaze on you for however long you want and the only true value you can find is in yourself because honestly I have tried I've been there I was gonna say I've tried them all I am don't worry I haven't tried everyone <laughs> that's not so wrong um, but basically, I'm older now and slightly wiser, although I do fall too easily for different guys. Um, but what I've realised as well, because I'm really busy and do a lot, because I'm not giving a man 24-7 attention, they have a real problem with me. And honestly, they're the first to come out the closet when you do something exciting in the media. Um, and then they're the first to disappear, do you know, actually, when you want something from them. So, do you know, those kind of guys, I always think, right, some of my hottest, most talented friends are single. Because to find someone who will accept them as they are, because this is what happens with men. They get attracted to us at first because they're like, oh, she's different. Oh, she's driven. Oh, that's sexy. That's hot. Um, oh, she's ambitious. Oh, she's got all this following or she's got this whole business or whatever career. They like that, but they don't like the reality of that because to be successful, you've had to work really hard. You've had to sacrifice a lot, which is probably why you're single. Um, and also you've been through a lot and they cannot accept it. So they don't like the reality. So then they try and put you in a box and then you try and get into the box and then you're like jack in the box and then you explode and you buy behind you. I've got positive affirmations and prayers this side. That side, I've got a whole box full of Ann Summers. Um, unfortunately, no toys. I've never used one. Right, I better go anyway because I am busy <laughs> having a life. So we and this is a lesson for me cannot find our value in a man we've got to find it in ourselves because we are badass bitches and that's why they cannot cope with this and it takes a good un, a real good un. and i like my friend always says don't accept a knight in tin foil you want a knight in rose gold armor maybe not rose gold but you know like proper good stainless steel at least like yorkshire stainless steel armor you don't want no knight in tin foil all right and even the ones in armor they're not gonna save you they just gotta be there to support you and we are better as we are and unless they're gonna be our tinny cheerleaders then they can do one so there's my wise words of the night